In this video, we will go over how to use and create layers in WeVideo, like an image layer or an audio layer. So we've got our video that we've already started in our previous tutorials with video and text added. I'm going to add an image layer. And so I've got images here in my media so far, and I'm going to find one that I want and drag and drop it and then double click to edit. So once I have it open, then I'm going to choose the animation tab and pick a start and end position and size. And this will allow my image to move across the screen as my video is going. So it will look like it is moving from the top left and getting a slightly larger and going to the bottom right. So I click done editing and then I can preview that and see what it would look like. So I want to add another image that will cross over this one, so I need a new layer. On the top left is a plus sign on the tracks, and it will say add a new track. I can add a video track or an audio track. For this one, I want a video track because I need to drag down an image, not an audio file. So I can drag down a new image and put it directly over my old one, double click to edit, and do the same thing. I'm going to choose a start size and position and end size and position. I'm choosing basically the opposite. I want them to crisscross on the screen and click done editing when I'm co it's complete and preview that so that I can see that they will crisscross on my screen in my video. And I've done that by adding those two layers. You can switch those by again dragging and dropping and moving them around. So now the green goes over the purple. I could add more layers to this if I wanted to add more images or text. I can drag my text over the top so that I have even more things happening in this video piece, um, but I don't need to have that. I also can add more layers for audio. You would do this if you wanted to add sound effects and a music track. So I've got my music track, so I'm gonna click that plus sign and choose audio track. So we'll add a second audio track to the bottom and I'm gonna choose a sound effect to go where I have my images swooping across the screen. Drag that down and put it at that spot. So that would be a reason why you would have two audio tracks if you had sound effects and music. And then I have my double image layer um, above that on top of my video one track. And you can add those with that plus sign on the top left. You can also adjust how you see your tracks. You can make them a little bit larger. And there's some editing capabilities as well. And if you hover over any of the tracks, you can see the trash can and delete that track. So I didn't need the video three, so I can get rid of that one. So don't be afraid to experiment and try new layers and tracks in WeVideo with your new projects. Don't forget to subscribe to the EdTech Team YouTube channel right here and check out the next video in our playlist.